Buena suerte. Batiste's trainer told us yesterday in our meeting with him if this can become a boxing match. In the center of the ring, slightly quicker advantages, particularly with his feet. Left uppercut landed for Matisse. Provodnikov coming back. Counter right hand by Matisse. One, two by Matisse, big left hook. Right at the left eye of Provodnikov. Matisse just threw a straight right hand. When he started putting that left hand, which he just did, that's going to be a big factor. He's pitting two or three punches. Matisse, Matisse. Uppercut by Matisse. Straight right hand by Matisse. Provodnikov just can't get going. Provodnikov. Provodnikov's heart might hold up, Jim, but I don't believe his face is going to hold up. Matisse is trying to throw that right uppercut every now and then after he throw combinations. But Rusland just come back with a full stop. And now Provodnikov lands a big left hand. Above his left eye. Harold Letterman giving the first two rounds third as well. He's very sharp. He's very sharp, Matisse is. He's throwing punches straight down the middle. Then he's coming up with the little uppercuts every now and then. Right hand, uppercut he tried to get there. Very devastating for Rusland to overcome, overcome that. The left hook lands for Provodnikov. Now right to the body. Now Provodnikov backs Matisse up and gets him on the ropes. Three to Ruslan Provodnikov. I thought he was more aggressive, landed some good shots coming forward. About the cut. That by focusing on the body, Provodnikov might be setting Matisse up for big counter shots upstairs. Absolutely, and also the referee is watching very carefully as I watch the referee. To a tremendous start in the first couple of rounds that appeared headed toward domination. Great right uppercut by Matisse. Comes back with a combination. Left hook by Provodnikov. Right cross by Provodnikov. Great body shot by Provodnikov and a right upstairs. Ducks a right hand. Big left hook from Provodnikov brings the fans out of their seats. Matisse, and now on Harold Letterman's unofficial scorecard, despite the great Matisse start, as always, coming back from getting hammered in the first two rounds and working his way back into the fight. And he's starting to land shots that could give him a chance to win. See Matisse headhunting more than taking the body from his, his, his attack. He should be throwing more body shots. And then coming up. Not much to choose between the two of them. Although, if anything, the harder punches have once again been landed. And also the power. His sister is a professional boxer. Provodnikov comes from one of those tiny, hard-bitten, impoverished Siberian towns where life itself is a fight for everyone. He's landed 40 punches in the round to only seven for Provodnikov. And still, Provodnikov throws. 10 seconds, 10 seconds. And looking at Provodnikov. Harold, how do you have it through six? Don't cry for me, Argentina. Four rounds to two, 48, 46, Lucas Matisse. Yeah, I mean, his blood running down his eye. He already got the gloves hitting him and taking his vision. He just got hit with a stiff jab just now. Of course, yes, it's, it's, it's bothering me. Provodnikov does at this moment. It's hard to figure exactly how he could do it tonight. But of course, nobody would have thought he would win rounds three and four. It only takes a little bit of foot movement from Matisse to slow down Ruslan Provodnikov's offensive attack. When you talk about leading somebody in to set up hitting them with something big, we saw a perfect thunderous power shot he has eaten from Lucas Matisse. Here's Provodnikov with another little mini comeback. That brings back crowd. We're rooting for the Siberian Rocky and want to see him. Hard right hand by Provodnikov. This 
despite the level of punishment which has been laid on him by Matisse. Some thoughts about shortening his career. That retirement is somewhere on his mind in the not too distant future. Right now, Matisse has Matisse has to go ahead and give him something to make him think. Matisse is not giving that type of feeling. And you know what? Los Angeles do four or five different good shots. Maybe Todd Durano. Right hands that would knock over telephone poles. So I think Bruce did has come on. Matisse ain't throw more punches than hard punches just to go ahead and get the referee's attention. Trying to force the referee to stop the fight. Well, trying to at least give Ruchland. Ruchland is used to those punches all, all night. Momentarily, Matisse was in the corner. Crowd got excited. Hard left hook by Provodnikov. Matisse is winning, no, but I don't no, think he's winning Provod that Hard far right that. hand by Provodnikov. Tremendous uppercut there by Matisse. They both exchanged left hooks to each other, and they both connected. Provodnikov were to win the last two rounds, he'd wind up with a draw. You heard Marvin Simodio telling Provodnikov. Hard body shot by Matisse. That could take some of the steam out of Provodnikov down the stretch. Quick, precise left hook. Now Matisse. Now they're finally back to work. And Provodnikov with a left hook and a right cross. And an uppercut. And a little body shots on a left hook. Another left hook. Matisse suddenly a little bit tempted. And Provodnikov left Good hook. Left hook. Just on it and got Matisse's attention. The buck with his legs. Knocks him into the corner. Lands a right hand. Lands a left hook. Lands another right hand. And another left hook. Huge comeback by Provodnikov in round 11. Warm embrace for the two fighters as they begin the last round. Provodnikov still digging. Fire away. Don't make it look as though Provodnikov has taken your game away. Big right hand by Provodnikov. Left hook, Provodnikov. Hard right hand from Provodnikov. Backs Matisse up. Only 40 seconds to go. Tape coming off of Matisse's glove again. Benji Estevez not going to stop the action here. By majority decision, Lucas Lamagina. Say